Governor Jennifer Granholm talks about her views on embryonic stem cell research and how it affects Michigan. I'm, I'm a co-chair of it. I'm on the committee. Um, I think it's very important for Michigan to be pro-science. Uh, I think that um, being pro-cure is being pro-life. I think that it's really important for us to do this in a way that is um, where we are not fostering uh, cloning or anything like that, but that it's consistent with what other states are doing, that is done in a very careful way, recognizing the, certainly the ethical concerns. But insofar as we have fertility clinics in Michigan and parents, uh, they make enough embryos, more than enough is necessary, and they throw away those extra embryos, if a parent gives their permission for those embryos to be used instead of in the trash can but for life-saving cures, I think that those embryos can therefore be used to save lives and make lives better for kids with juvenile diabetes and adults with paralysis. I think that, that the finding those cures is an important way to create a win-win out of it. It's also important for Michigan um, to, you know, we have the toughest, we have, we're among the toughest in the nation. I think there's like three states that have extremely, um, that, are, that criminalize this research. Um, I think that's, a, that's not a good message for the scientific community to know. We want to attract scientists. We want to attract those who are interested in finding cures. Um, I think it's great the advancements that have been made in stem cell research, and I hope that they continue, both embryonic as well as, um, you know, umbilical, all of that, adult stem cell research, all of that needs to, to happen. As long as we can be assured that it's done in an ethical way, I think Michigan needs to be progressive in that sense rather than being viewed as a backwater.